exotics and low riders from my house. I dreamed about it. Now all I do walk out my front door and I see I got it. We can do it all night, baby. And I did see I did it on any level. Rolex, bezel, Ferraris, and Bella. Yeah, yeah. We can do it all night, baby. Slam. Smack it up and flip it, then I rub it down Zip it up and then I ship it to another town Smoking hella weed while me and Willie bust a couple pounds I don't know anymore Plus I'm on the road now, different color old now Lay back on the dope, I'm getting dollars off my shows now Bitches wanna tie me down, but I ain't in that mode now <laughs> Poverty is often part of a system, not an event A catastrophe can introduce poverty to a village or a family, but too often poverty is generational, systematic, and amplified by some of the very forces designed to eradicate it. Powerful. Hey, uh, we're here to do today an album by Freddie Gibbs, Currency. I've seen a lot of comments that wanted us to do this, and I also, being a fan of Freddie Gibbs and Currency, would like to do this as well. I know you're familiar with Freddie Gibbs, but are you familiar with Currency? I'm not. As w I've only heard features, never heard an album by Currency, so mm. don't know Cur what to expect. He's been rapping for, uh, I think, over 10 years now. He's probably the king of cloud rap. I don't know if that's the right thing, like weed rap. So he his raps are heavily influenced around weed. And also the production is very sort of chill style, a lot of sort of older samples. Really, really dope. And he's kind of got like his own, he's, got, he's huge in the underground, but not really much else. Okay. Uh, I'm looking so forward to this. Same, I'm really interested. Freddie's a great artist. And also Alchemist, I believe, has produced the whole album. So okay. if you're familiar with Alchemist production. Yeah, they're in good hands. Yeah, man. So we, I really liked Freddie Gibbs' Freddie. But I think we can get something completely different here. And yeah. I think he, as I've said before, I think he's one of the most versatile artists to flow on beats. Very similar to Danny Brown. Completely different artists, but I believe that they can flow on anything the fuck they want. That's just how I feel about Freddie. He just, his, his, the way that he flows, he can flow on any motherfucking thing he wants. And he's shown that time and time again on his mm. last albums. So I think we're going to get very currency-like production here, but Freddie's going to do his thing. We have a short, punchy album. Fetty. Let's do it. Let's get it. What's Fetty mean? Con confetti? Freddie and currency. There's no C in it. Oh, hang on, pause for a second. Why? Go ahead, talk. It's only in intro. Not true. Uh, because um, uh, currency's nickname is Spitter Andretti. That's like his nickname, Spitter Andretti, so Andretti Fetty. So that's what we get. Huh. That's a bit clever. Spitter. You feel like this would be lyrically heavy or more uh, feel, sound, bounce? I think more feel. Okay. More production feel. More production. So it's currency. Yeah. Where's he from? Where's that voice from? I'm not See how I said Andretti there? Yes, yeah, yeah, there you go. Call the chiropractic, this necklace is extra heavy on me. 1963 gold D, I went Andretti on me. Louisiana, New Orleans. There you go. Cause I'm a bitch, I hit the sick of bitch. L train, bless me, you broke me off when I hit the bricks. The voice echoing is very tribal like. Echoing. Yeah, the... Oh, the background vocal. It's kind of like he's like. Le I love that legend in this. It's like legend in this bitch. Something something hologram. Like two packs hologram. Exactly. Coachella. Yeah, that's that's a clever line. Freddie has such smooth vocals, man. Bruh. He's super smooth. He's one of the most underrated in the game. Yeah, he's not that big, man. Really dope first track. I love nice the. Intro. Yeah, really love the slowness of it. The backing vocals. Currency sounded really nice in there. As I thought, the vocal, the track, the beats are going to be made more so for Currency's voice. But Freddie, as I said, can flow motherfucking anything. He's amazing, and he was so infectious on this track. I feel like he has more of a presence than Currency. Currency's more kind of a bit more hazy, a bit more like I can zone him out and just. Like I said, he's like the king of cloud rap. Right, so. makes sense. The blow. I'm gonna drink more of your, your, your urine. Thank you for peeing this for me. Anytime. Sandy's urine. Beautiful. Anytime, bro. That's another Patreon reward, man. Ah. Chop, chop, chop style. Shot the guys in here, big numbers in my roll me down. My baby said if I be faithful, she gon' hold me down. I can cut and pack, I be switching records like Joker. Stood up on my dean, I'm a 
machine ain't never promoted that. Yeah. Coldest nigga you ever heard on Ellen the oldest shit. Yeah. Blow a motherfucking mohawk and get a black van with a red stripe. Nigga say I got a boy's wet. I shot him in the face. The pussy boy was dead right. Nigga dead right. It's just freestyle. Let a nigga breathe. Ghost face. I got ice cream. Russian Puerto Rican. Black and black and knees. That was dope. That was really dope. Oh. Great book. You copy it wrong, I'm out of my hobby There's a dude buggers and Kawasaki's You gotta know how to have fun with your money Young hustler, watch me, keep killers around me Loving Freddy's opening verse there Oh man they, they work well together Really dope, actually it's really funny because Currency's next verse, he tried to match Freddy's flow If you notice, Currency isn't really known for rapping in that manner Okay. Because currency sped things up a bit. He's normally he's normally like one to just really flow with the beat and really chill out. Mm. So for him to sort of match Freddy on that level was very sort of outside for him. I so. didn't pick up on that. It's interesting. So really, 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 really dope from both of them, and um, it's just such a vibe. The production is just so beautiful. The sampling, and the, the like, there's so many sampling like in between all this and the transition transitions. The sampling transitions are dope. Alchemist, you kill it. No. Come on, come on. Who else does the Alchemist work with? Bro. Like Mac Miller and Staples? Yeah, he's pretty much named every big artist he's worked with. I'm not even kidding. Kanye, Jay-Z? Yeah. Really? 100%. Yeah. What a boss. Producers fly under the radar, man. You, you, you saw, I wouldn't notice the Alchemist walking past me in the street. Pretty sure the Alchemist is tough for like Kanye's first two albums. You can hear it in this. Oh, I love this production. I got a rolling collection. You look and build collectors. Rockin' virtual hair max. All white good crap. I got the razor blade and clippers. You get your shit pushed back. I turn some shit to sugar cane. A nigga couldn't look back. I promise every bitch I fucked in 2018 was a foreigner. Dead homies in my wall. I wow. look like a corner. <laughs> good on him. <laughs> we shot you that black shit. Black. Oh, I don't want to end, bro. You love that production, don't you? I love it. I love it, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Alchemist is killing it. Bro. The combination of the three, Alchemist, Currency, Freddy, they all work well together. So well. I don't really have much to say man. on that track. Um, Currency it. matched it so well. Freddy, I even like the part where Freddy Gibbs started talking between the verse, but he rap talked it. Like, so he just like speed talk? Yeah, like, man. Talk. It's just so fucking intelligently done, man. He's. Fuck, man. Oh, it was beautiful. I'm fucking with this heavy. I fuck with this heavy, man. Now and later, Gators. How you doing, Baiters? Hey. Take your bitch. Oh, bro. It's got this like, old school vibe. It's real refined. This is like early soul rap, man. It's rhythm and poetry. Oh. Check this is Freddy. This is classic Freddy. This is smooth ass Freddy. Remember that track on Freddy? Yeah, it's like that. Singing Freddy. White two tone is the name like. Fuck rapping in the state, Freddy like. How you living, nigga, little man like. Oh, now you're. This all night long. Hey. It's how I serenade my women. This is why I have no women except yeah. one. My dick puts on a little top hat, little cane, and starts singing and twirling. It starts walking off you. Imagine that. It starts walking on his little balls. Yeah. And it starts, and then the fucking the little eye of the dick like opens up and starts whistling. We can do it all night, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We can do it all night, baby. We can do it all night, baby. I I will not be listening to that track again. You didn't like it? It's funky. It's funny. I have no interest in going back to. Oh no, baby! I thought it was awesome. Yeah, bro, you put it on. The fucking guitar and the bass. The production and the fucking was nice. Keys. I ain't knocking the production. Bro, I thought that track was beautiful. Man.
Top currency 10. was currency wasn't even <laughs> it's the best track of the fucking year. <laughs> currency wasn't even needed on there. It was that good? All right, that track was dope. Don't listen to this man. Now listen to him. His his, his opinion isn't as important as mine, but it's still important. <laughs> hey man, I'm just one motherfucking guy. I I thought you were ten. Out of ten. Hey yo. No window tints. What the fuck happened there? <laughs> the production is super cohesive. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. Dashboard, lavish, 14 karat gold instruments. I'm outside looking at it. I didn't even sit in it yet. I can't believe that it's just how I envisioned it. Can't hide when you just fly. Them niggas is seeing it. Taking in the sunset on the lake. While reminiscing how narrowly I escaped. They don't want no smoke. Them niggas broke. They want handouts. I'd rather hand them a rope. Standing in one place won't get you paid. Find desperation shots, but I'm not faked. It's like a pony. It's really interesting. We got a track from um, Freddy and then Currency. Exactly. Yeah. It's like the, it's pretty balanced. Yeah, it's really interesting because. Welcome home. Yeah, skip on. That was dope. That was dope, Currency. Arkham is killing you. We're just gonna keep it going. We'll keep it rolling, man. Willie Lord. Willie Lord. more Freddy like right now. You know, boy. Give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. That's what I'm talking about oh, right there, bro. Freddie Gibbs. Freddie went the fuck in. Absolutely. That's that's the best track on this album for me so far. I even loved in the verse where he like loaded the gun halfway uh -huh. during the verse and uh -huh. then a shot at the very end of the first verse. Clever. Really dope. That that's that's where I think Freddie Gibbs is is, is nearly pretty much at his best when he has that spooky vibey beat and he is just boom boom bar boom, for bar for bar. bar. Yeah. The whole executing. way through. The whole way through, man. Didn't let up. Didn't stop Fuck moving. a hook, man. Bruh. Fuck your choruses. Bruh. Bruh. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Beautiful guitar. Is that Eleferios? I see you. Okay. Fucking beautiful. That guitar with the extra guitar behind it occasion, the keys behind it as well. Alchemist is shining the fuck on this album. And not only was Currency's verse really dope, start off, Freddie Gibbs went fucking in on the end. Fuck, man. He just had me fucking captivated like a motherfucker, man. I'm just a very happy individual right now with this shit. He doesn't, even though his tone may stay the same, his flow doesn't. He's able to pick it up and drop it down mm. in his own pacing and that, that keeps it engaging. Oh, that was amazing. Last track. Yeah. Bundy and Sincere. Yeah. Did he just 
mention Mac Miller then? Thought so. I didn't hear exactly what he said though. <laughs> Includes a Man. banding confetti. That was dope. I'm glad there it wasn't was, a bad track on there, man. There wasn't a bad track. I'm glad it was short and sweet. Absolutely. No need to add more to it. Uh, the chemistry between these three artists is absolutely amazing. I just want to give a big special shout out to Currency. I think he's one of the hardest working rappers in the game. He releases like two to three pro things a year, man. Really? Has released like two to three things a year for like the past 10 years. He has or hasn't? Has. I'm not even kidding you. He drops so much music, man. Good on him. He is hard working and everything he drops is normally always good quality music. I mean, I'm much here, much here more so for Alchemist and Freddie, but it's really good to see Currency. You're more here for Alchemist up. than Freddie? No, for both of them. I'm here more for Alchemist and Freddie than Currency. Oh, okay. And Freddie. Okay. But to see, but to like just see how Currency fits in with it and just step up and really fucking yeah. add to it is really beautiful. Uh, uh, but Alchemist was the highlight in this album for me. His right. production on here was flawless the whole way through, the whole way through. And I've been listening to a lot of Alchemist's more uh, his more instrumental tapes beforehand. He's been a lot more experimental, so very more hit and miss for me. But here, it's all hit. But this was a team effort. No, let's let's yeah. make sure that's clear, right? Hundred percent. These artists work very well together and could easily go ahead and do their own thing and make a gang of albums like this. Yeah, it's impressive. Really fucking dope. Love everything with this album. Uh, excited to go back to it and see how I really feel about it in different moods, different settings, like just to see how it fits in with all that. But when I hear a song like... Is this track six? Oh. Like Willie Lloyd? Oh. Come on, son! When I hear a Bruh. song like Willie Lloyd, it just gets me real excited to Bruh. hear Freddie. Also, I really love how this year Freddie has done an album which he kind of trolled a bit because he did like a, a, a like a the rollout with the video was yeah bit, where he's uh, singing weird. and we're just like oh we're getting a singing album from Vic and then that was the only singing track in the album and the rest of the album was trap bangers so he's gone from making a trap album and kind of trolled a little on it to making an album like this yeah. just shows his versatility absolutely and if this doesn't get you hyped for the bandana his next album with Mad Madonna what the fuck else will we still, I still gotta go back and listen to their, their first project. Pinata? Yeah. Bruh. I feel like we should do a review. Bruh. We should do a reaction, man. I've already listened to it a thousand times, but you can do I it. I haven't. I'll sit next to you and do it. There we go. If you want to see it, let us know. I fuck with this heavy. Yeah, man. It's been a good, good week for music. Hip hop is continually impressing me in 2018. We're if still you, got another month. If you guys want to see these videos, these reactions early, go ahead and become a channel member on YouTube. Just click the join button on our... Uh, main youtube page if you or, want to see it early or also you can join our patreon as well yeah that too five yeah. dollars a month man ten cents a day i fuck with this i'm gonna see go, ya. i'm gonna get masturbate now I, I best get out the way then no i want you to watch i want you to sit in a closet and just dress up as uh the mask